What's up guys, Justin Body here with the new Black Ops emblem. It's my personal emblem that I made for my website, so I hope you guys enjoy the tutorial video on how to make it. So, let's get started. First we are going to start out with a red background with a shield burst background also with it. And then we are going to uh, start working on the bod part, so we'll start with the B. And then we're going to turn that white. Make sure it's centered perfectly straight in the middle. And this time I actually made it a little bit smaller than the actual size before this one. To make it um, fit actually perfectly on here. Okay, then we get the crown. Then we're going we're gonna to use the toggle outline. We're going to make it like an outline where it's just the, you guys know, a little sketch of it. I actually found out that's actually a lot better than having just the full crown and then duplicating it and then putting a different color on top of it. It's the best I can do, but uh, we'll use the toggle outline for the white and then the red will be the inside color of the crown. It's going to be this is a different color compared to my bod uh avatar that I have on YouTube. It's just a different color. Try to get it as close as possible. Since they don't have any good circles, I used uh, cog, and then just to make the emblem look a little bit better, I put a splat, I think is what they call it on here. Yeah, splat, I put, uh, turn that red, put that as the same background color as the square that's red, just to blend in. Try to put that in the middle or close to the middle, so like right there. And then we'll shift the cog over and shift the B over so everything's just perfect instead of being all shoved to the left side. So there we go. Now it's time to move that. And that. But I, I tried to give it like a machinima slash bod studios look kind of. Kind of it kind of those arrows kind of re remembers me of machinima basically, their emblem. That's what came to mind right when I started making this, when my friend was with me, Crazy Peanut. When he was in the lobby, I was making this while he was talking. Okay, then we're going to use a bing or a ring. <laughs> I can't see it. Ring. It's so, it's so small on my screen. So ring right there, and then we're going to use a thin rectangular line piece to make the staff of the D. So that would be all for the D, and then we're going to use the... I don't know if you would call them like 3D stars or something, but it's the group of stars that we're going to use. And instead of putting the star burst front uh, upside down, I decided to go just perfectly how it is because I had room for it actually and it actually looked pretty cool. And that will be a dark blue. And then I was like, I'm missing something, so I... I'm going to put the rectangular piece, I'm going to enlarge it so it's going to enlarge the background so it's going to be all black. So basically that is all I have did for this video or emblem. So I hope you guys like it and enjoy the rest of the other, other videos that are going to be up today. Also follow me on Twitter and Facebook, the link will be in the description at the bottom. So. Thanks for watching guys and I hope you enjoyed this emblem video. I'll have one up possibly next week on a new emblem or maybe a new wager match gameplay. So my wager match gameplay got ruined so I was actually going to put 6 up but now it's down to 5 so thanks for watching guys and I hope you appreciate my videos that I've been putting up so thank you.